But how am I gonna pop insights? Okay. Um, yeah, 100%. The tower boost. Okay. Sell. Oh, they, they're all out of me. Just go for Spear of the Force. Spear of the Force is the best. Is the best. Is, is actually OP, guys. Okay, I'm not really, I'm not really sure why I, uh, picked this hero, but I wanted to show you guys the lobby. I don't, usually don't show you guys the lobby, but look, I have a three win streak right now. After the last game, I got, I had a three win streak. So, I, I feel like this is pretty cool. Now, I, I, okay, so I need to get a four, a fourth win streak so I can see whether it's four or not. Whether it stays in four, or it stays in three, or whether it shows I have a four win streak. If it shows I have a four win streak, that'll be, that'll be dope. Then like, I can like go for like a 10 or 20 win streak and then like my opponent will be like Oh my goodness, I'm facing an opponent with a 20 win streak, can I beat him? And then like, and then he'll lose and then they'll lose and then, and then they'll be sad, you know? Alright, anyway, uh, I started off with attack. I, I should have started off with uh, Striker Jones. I don't know, I don't know why I picked Striker Jones. I should have picked, I was gonna pick Quincy and now I was gonna pick Jericho. And then I click Quincy, and then I click Jericho, and then I click Quincy, and then I click Jericho, and then I click Striker Jones, because it works with, well with a mortar. I don't know. That was my logic. But we'll try to we'll try to push all masters. Right? We're gonna try to push all masters. We'll try to win win each game as fast as as fast as I can. Um, and yeah, at the same time, show you guys how to how how to win, how to win stuff. You know, my opponent's going engineer with. Is that Fate Weaver Adoro, however you call it? I think that's the name, right? Fate Weaver Adoro. Interesting. Okay. I'm gonna go for Blade Shooter. Did Blade Shooter get nerfed? I don't think so. Still in $750. Not really sure. Alright. Uh, so that Fate Weaver Adora, I thought I heard that it was pretty broken last season, but I, I didn't really I don't have it, and I haven't really played last season. Um so, also, I'm going to place a boat down. I want to go for a merchantman farm, alright? That's my plan. Merchantman farm is going to be help me out a lot. Mm. At the same time, maintain my eco. So, maintain my eco, maintain a good eco, and get merchantman farm. That's going to be the plan. Mm. So, I have mortar, tack, and boat. I feel like this is a very good loadout on this map. Hmm. This this loadout sometimes can get sketchy, but I still feel like it's the best loadout on this map. There's not really many loadouts that are too great on this map. In this loadout, you can defend pretty much any rush um, until round 30. Obviously, you can't pop bads on this map. No, we're not. But <laughs> most games are not going to go to round 30 on this map. So you just gotta defeat your opponent before round 30, which should be very very easy. You can pop DDTs pretty well too with the mortars, bloom incineration stuff, and then like you can pop. You can pop those group moabs. I haven't actually sent a set of group moabs yet. I, I want to try to do that in today's video. All right, I'm gonna try to send a group a set of group moabs. Also, I I don't know. Could I've gotten merchantman last round? Was it possible to get merchantman last round? All right, my opponent got up two double shots. All right, my opponent sold a double shot. All right, my opponent places down another engine. Goes for what is he going for? Pin? Is that pin? I think that's pin. Oh. Okay, they, they want me to upgrade my tax shooter. Alright, very well, I'll upgrade my tax shooter. <laughs> okay, I upgraded my tax shooter. Alright, is going for another boat too greedy? Bro, I forgot how to play this game. Am I supposed to go for another boat or not? Is it even possible to fit four boats here? I think it is, right? Is it possible to fit four boats? The ultimate question. Alright, I'm not gonna try though. I think I'll just go for a, a mortar right now just to be safe. Uh, once I get better at the game, I'll, I'll go for, I'll start going for a second boat. But you know, still warm up. Oh, didn't mean to go for a signal flare. Uh, we didn't quite need that until my opponent sent me sent me camos. Until my opponent sends me camo, can't talk. My opponent also has boat, and looks like they're gonna try to also go for a merchant man, but but with grape shots, or with hot shots. All right, I think I'm gonna send them a set of leads just to block, you know, block the sentry stuff, and then send them a bunch of. These, these stuff, black ones, and then purple ones. I think they should be able to take down my opponent, or at the very least force a tower boost. Yeah, oh, what what did Fate Weaver Adora do? Just ate up like half the balloons. Just ate up half the balloons, okay, well, I got the victory. All right, I think I have a four win streak now. Um, I'm gonna try to build up that win streak. Yep, four, 
four trophies. All right. Try to build up that win streak, you know. Play a battle. Play. Come on, click battle. And yeah, four win streak. Not bad. Okay, so now this is the ultimate question. Does it show that a four win streak? It does. Okay. So my opponent. I don't know if my opponent can see it though. Can my opponent see that I have a four win streak? Because I haven't matched anyone with a three win streak yet. And it doesn't show until you have like a three win streak. Oh, I don't know why I skip Basalt Columns. It's horrible. It's a great map. Basalt Columns is one of my favorite maps. It's a short map. It doesn't. It's always action, you know. And it, it requires a fast reaction. Uh, Sands of Time. I think this is a good map to try out Etienne, right? Oh, if I can click on it. Uh, I've actually lost on this map quite a bit of times. So. Uh, my opponent's going Druid. I'm gonna try this loadout. Hopefully it's not a bad idea because this opponent has been in Hall of Masters before. It ha they had a Hall of Masters badge. Uh, they, uh, I also have a Hall of Masters badge too. I have a, I have a better badge than them. It's a top 50 badge. <laughs> they have a top 75. Is that 75%? You can't tell because the percent sign is like tiny. Can you guys tell? Can you guys see the percent sign is like tiny? So it's top, top 75%. It's not top 75. Top 75 is another badge. I think. Wait, I don't think there's a top 75 badge at all. I think it's just top 75. Top se top 100 and top 50. Anyway, what am I talking about? Alright. I'm ranting. Uh, so, I'm gonna go for Druid. And then, I think I'm gonna go for a... A... My hero. Go for it. So, this is the thing. I don't know where to place my hero. I think I'm gonna place it, place place Etienne here. Um, I'm gonna place her here, and then I'll send. Oh, my opponent's always also going Druid. They have Oban. I think Oban's a better hero, but I, I kind of want to test out Etienne. You know, I want to test out Etienne. Okay, I'm gonna actually go try to go for two Druids because last time I only went for one and it didn't work very well. It didn't work out very well for me. I'm gonna go for two Hard Thorns. Um, and then I'm going to have to upgrade them eventually into Heart of Vengeance. I have no banana farms right now, but don't worry. But look, this is so cool. Etienne, Etienne shows what balloons my opponent are sending at me right now. And shows my opponent's cash, which is very important. Because cash is sometimes hard to estimate, you know? Uh, sometimes hard to estimate your opponent's cash. Also, okay, Etienne. He'll be more useful than letting all the balloons go through. Um, I'll go for a Heart of Vengeance then. I'll go for two Heart of Vengeance just so I can get my Druid Leaks down. And... Bro, so interesting to see my opponents, like... I, I, like, the last time I used Etienne too, my opponents just, like, they, they don't hold the button. And... They don't hold the button, they just send. They, like, click on it, you know? They don't hold it, they, they click on it. Like, they click on it, like this. Yeah, it's so interesting to see them do that. Uh, I should have sent Pink Balloons, uh, by the way. I don't know why I haven't done that. I should have definitely sent Pink Balloons. Um, pink balloons would definitely do damage. Wait, they don't have their druid. What is this druid spot? I just realized they placed a druid in a horrible spot. This is going to get, uh, this is going to force some, some defense. I actually don't know how good double druid defense. The last time I went double druid was a very long time ago. Um, yeah, I'm going to go for a, go for this, go for this. Um... Okay, I don't know how good my double druid is doing. Okay, okay, very bad. Um, yeah, apparently very bad, very bad. Okay, I'm I, I'm gonna go for a heart of thunder. That defends surely. Okay, not okay. My farms are horrible. I do not like this at all. But I did get my druid leak, so my, both my druids attack fairly fast now. The game's like lagging still. It's alright. It's alright. I can eat the slag. It's been lagging ever since update 4.0 came out. I think I said that already. Um, <laughs> what is this Oban? Oh, what is this Oban? Bunny ear Oban. Alright. Talking about random stuff. Alright. Um. So yeah, my farms are a lot worse than his. My, farm are, my farms are a lot worse than... What the heck? That's Spike Factory. Druid Farm Spike Factory. I thought it was 100% sub. But I thought... The third tower is 100% sub. Didn't think it was gonna be Spike Factory, but alright. All drones have increased pierce. Drones get in touch. Speed and infrared for camera detection. So I need level 8 for camera, level 5 for camera detection. Man. 
but that's only for that's only drones getting camo detection. So that doesn't. So I still can't defend camo leads or anything. Yeah, uh, I'll go for the U. My farms are pretty doing pretty okay actually. Um, okay, this is gonna be the last farm that I'm gonna get. I actually, have more farms than my opponent. Fun fact: my opponent. So my opponent has spike factories. So they have to build up their defense before I rush them. Well, as I, I can build up my defense after they rush me. You know. But okay, but there is a small problem of not having. The small problem, not having um. Not having the best tower in the game, the submarine. It's not the best tower in the game, but. Not having that tower is, is going to hurt me a bit. So usually I'll have the submarine and the submarine with a D camo everything, and then I'll go upgrade that for to a reactor. Oh, sh um, that shreds. I can also go for Druid of Wrath. I think I'll go for that, and then um, if they don't send me anything, I actually don't have to upgrade it to level seven. They have a deadly. They have this spy factory right now. I don't know if I can send them a camel, a camel rush. I'm kind of tempted, not gonna lie. Okay, they're gonna send me a pretty big rush that doesn't do anything. Um, okay, I can't read rushes anymore. All right, let's go for a marketplace, and then go for a. Bro, what do I go for? How do you even farm now? I forgot how to farm. Is like, ba is the bank any good? Are you supposed to go for a bank? I should have gone for the banana plantation beforehand. My opponent has also been ecoing for a while too. So, that's not good. That means my opponent has way more money. This opponent's decent actually. But I do have a lot more farms than them, look. I have two third tier farms, my opponent only has uh, two tiers. What is this druid targeting though? I have, I have something to say about his druid targeting. I, 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 yeah, I do want to comment about his druid targeting. Typically, would want to keep it on like a better spot than this. Okay, they are not sending me anything, which is scary because that means they can wow me. Um, so I think my next step is gonna be going for a stronger stimulant. Yeah, stronger stimulant seems okay. Or, or I can go for a. I'll go for this then. Go for this. I, I don't know if it does anything. Here, I'll do this. This will help clear up fortified balloons. What is my opponent doing? My opponent's not sending me any balloons, nor is he farming. Nor are they farming. They're not collecting the bananas. Are they AFK? Okay, there they go. They, they, they put a banana farm down now. Okay. It scares me so much when my opponent does nothing. Like, when my opponents do nothing, I don't want to eco because they're going to randomly rush me. And because I don't have a submarine, I don't know how to defend con uh, properly. Or are they scared that I'm gonna rush them? Well, I'm not sending them anything, just kidding. Just realize it's gonna be a pretty good idea to rush them right now. In fact, I'll send one of this, one of these, and yeah, I'll just let it be. I'll just send one of one fortified mod. I don't know, I don't know how good it'll do. Okay, it makes them upgrade to the to the fourth tier, which is fine. Uh I'll I'll keep ecoing on top of that. They go for a pop list, which doesn't do anything by itself, I don't think. You need other stuff for for the poplars to do anything. To do. Okay. Oh, this my factory just shredded my fortified mod. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. My fortified mod just got shredded by my opponent's spike factory. That's that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Okay, I'm gonna go for a fourth tier or a fourth tier farm. Um. My opponent gone for my opponent has. Okay, they sent me a fortified BFB. It's pretty nice that I can see what they're sending me. Uh, do I go for a pop list? What do I do? It's fortified. Okay, I'll go for this, and then I'll go for a. I'll go for this, and I'll go for pop list. I don't know if pop list is a move. I, I don't even know how to use pop list. Two fortified BFBs. All right, I'll go for this, and then should I buy level ten? Okay, I'm gonna try level ten. I'm gonna use it and then tower boost, and I'm gonna go for ball lightning. And I'm going to go for a... Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. I honestly, to be honest with you guys, I don't know what I'm doing. Alright. I don't know how to use Etienne. I would w usually War of Treasus, you know? Like what they're doing right now, a War of Treasus. Okay, my eco is horrible. I don't know what I'm doing. I said that multiple times already. Um, I can't sell this anymore. There's nothing to do. I just have to wait. 
It's too late to keep Ecoin, huh? Alright, I'm gonna try to go for a very, very late Wall Street, I guess. How, do, how am I supposed to even pop DDTs? Hmm. I can pop DDTs with lead to gold, right? They can pop DDTs with their spike factory. Okay, so it would be really nice if I can see how much income they have right now. I, I literally can't see how much eco they have. Can't see how much eco they have. And and let's a group by the way. Oh power boost this. Um Am I am I dead to this? Bro, since when did this rush come out? Since when does this rush exist? What? Since when did this rush exist? Okay, since last season, but okay. That did in fact scare me a bit. Made me sell a farm. Probably an overreaction, huh? <laughs> it was a 1.9k percent. I should have definitely just got up a, uh, a w one of those things, one of the middle paths things, so that they don't regrow. Okay, I don't think I think this is gonna be the last time that I'm using this hero. <laughs> uh, to be honest, guys, just to be perfectly honest, I think this is gonna be the last time I'm going to use this hero. Okay, they sent me fortified UMG. Um. Oh my gosh. Why does my opponent have to do me like that? Alright, I'll go for a Poplist Army. Uh, I'll definitely Tower Boost this. Um, yeah, to be perfectly honest, I have no idea what I'm doing. I think I'm going to go for Spirit of the Forest. I think that was that, that that's like the way you're supposed to defend these. Um... Well, how am I gonna pop the insides? Okay. Um, yeah, 100%. Tower boost, okay. Sell. Oh, they, they're all out of me. Just go for Spear of the Force. Spear of the Force the best, is the best, is, is actually OP, guys. Trust me. It's OP, it's gonna shred all this. Now they're ecoing. Why are you ecoing? Why are you ecoing? Why are you ecoing, buddy? Okay. And then, and then I'm gonna go for some oak. Okay, this is actually not over. It's actually not quite over here. It's actually not quite over. But if I lose right here, I'm gonna be mad. Nah, I'm good. I'm good anytime time day. Alright, so these can't pop lead balloons. I just sold my... No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Alright. I'm gonna go for a bunch of lead to golds. I don't know. I think they're... I think they... They pop DDT as well. And I... But I don't have tire boost, so that's a problem. They're, they're, they're shredding it. My lead to golds are shredding the DDTs. Bro, I'm the best player in the game. I, I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. Sphere of the Forest. That that was just a horrible rush sent by my opponent. I could have definitely played better, but... Fortified, okay. I don't think those do anything either. I think my opponent's just stunzoed. My opponent's just stunzoed. I have nothing to do. Okay. I, I'll give them a thumbs up. They have, they have no eco right now. They have zero. Zero eco. Okay. Send them for send them group like group 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 BFBs. They surrender. Nice. This was the first time that um uh, that that my opponents that I got sent uh BFBs or group 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 stuff. You know, group Moabs, group and group Leds. That was scary. <laughs> anyway, that was a good game though.